Climate impacts, it's already taking entire countries, regions, villages, um, in, in terms of extreme heat, extreme flooding. It would be a disservice to ourselves to not study climate today. When I reflect on climate change, it seems to me that the world needs all of the people to think about climate change some of the time, and some of the people to think about climate change all of the time. The climate crisis is probably the single most important problem humanities face today. How we respond to it now will very much shape the world we live in in the coming decades and, and in the generation or future generations. I feel like one of the uh, amazing things about being at Columbia University is that you have access to so many different disciplines, so many different schools, uh, just the nature of the course structure it is. Uh, it allows you to build your course and your education the way you would want to. The Climate Society program teaches you how to utilize science, um, not just for the sake of it being science, but also for its usefulness to people and society, and I think that's a special thing about the program. The program is truly interdisciplinary uh, in the sense that students are very, very interdisciplinary. They come from very diverse backgrounds and the courses are encouraging students to work together. And I think that's probably one of the strongest pieces about the program is having that diversity of knowledge where um, collaboration is open and people are able to interact with each other um, because I think that's, that's really where a lot of the, the learning happens. Like, not just in the classroom, but outside, you know, having conversations with other people from other backgrounds. The clear focus on climate here in the Climate School provides a center which connects everyone. Our alumni find that the core that they had here had sustained them not only through the 12 months, but beyond. It gives them a common language, a common purpose, a community, a sense of meaning. In my year, there were climate communicators, there were climate artists, there were climate scientists, there were people going to environmental law. There's a whole range of different pathways that you can choose and personalize your courses based on your interest. One of the reasons I chose Columbia was New York City. In its cosmopolitan nature, it, it also opens up a space for a lot of networking, meeting people from various backgrounds. Um, and not just people in climate, you know, uh, but people from across the spectrum of politics. Uh, studying in New York uh, is, is life-changing. Uh, I remember between classes, I would go to museum openings and art shows and, and gallery walks that I was just invited to just because I was a student here. There's so many connections that the students can make by being here at Columbia and by being here in New York City. So in terms of outcomes, there isn't really one path out of this program. Students can take what they're learning from the program and apply it to any domain. From the inaugural class alone, students have gone into over 30 different fields, consulting to energy, TV and film, law, architecture and design, just to name a few. The program also contains an element uh, we call internship or a capstone. Uh, that is the summer semester. It's a 12-month program, so you have fall semester and then the spring semester and the summer is focused on taking all the skills uh, they learn in the program and then trying to apply it to, to the real-world problems. So you're directly taking part in the professional activities with the guidance of experienced Columbia faculty who themselves have done direct professional work. I'm passionate about um, helping people and I'm also passionate about research. So what I would like to do is help provide people with information that's useful in decision making that can help people adapt to climate change and also mitigate climate change. To me, one of the most important things that I hope to accomplish through my career is to lessen the burden of climate change on populations most disproportionately impacted by real world climate impacts. My role personally is as a writer and as a journalist. That's what I know how to do. I know how to ask questions and I, I know that's a very small part of the whole spectrum of change that we need. But um, I hope to continue to do that. The impact I want to have after this program really 
focuses on disadvantaged communities. Uh, we all know that everybody doesn't feel climate the same, so really a focus on environmental justice and being able to use my skills from engineering or the things I learned about making policy changes that bring a change. I'm going to help as many people as I can meet the needs of the most climate insecure folks on our planet and the good that I'm able to do, I know is only gonna be amplified, and I know that for a fact. I'm gonna change the world.